Good evening. Okay, it's Friday and the body knows it. Good evening, guys. Turn on your cameras if you can, please. Say hello. It's Friday the 13th. Johnny, you're so in the dark, Johnny. Yeah. We're only eight people. Where are the others? Let's just wait. Hola. Voy a dar clases. Hablamos a diez. ¿Mm? Voy a dar clases. Voy a estar aquí. ¿Mm? Me, me. Okay, we are nine now, so let's start. I know you're not, we're not complete yet, but it's 8.01 already, so let's do it. Ada Susena Cáceres Mendoza. Present, teacher. Alexander de Jesus Sanchez Soto. Present. Carla Ivania Cabrera Serrano. Okay. Claudia Maricela Solano Crespin. Present teacher. Thank you, Claudia. Thank you. Elvin Arcides Eguizabal Martinez. Present. Fatima Ifegenia Lopez Ramos. Fernando. Bye. Bye. Okay, Fatima Ifegenia Lopez Ramos, Fernando José, perdón, Fernando Ernesto Cosme Morales, Isela Liliana Miranda Espinosa, José Antonio Cubías Hernández, Carla Yanet Amaya Herrera, Miguel Ángel Paz Landaverde, Miriam Carolina Mozo Valdés. Present. Excellent. René Alfonso Madrid Escalante. Present teacher. Gracias, René. Reina Marisabel Álvarez de Chávez. Roberto Luis Umaño Orellana. Sabrina Mabel Latín Castro. Sandra Elizabeth Osorto Romero. Present. Thank you. William Alexander Ramirez Flores. Jocelyn Imelda Rivas Abarca. Thank you, Jocelyn. Present. <laughs> Alan Christopher Abrego Brizuela. Carolina Present. Ivette. Present. Sorry, Alan is not here. Okay. Carolina Ivette Romero Avelino. Johnny Vladimir Portillo. Chávez. Present teacher. José Alfredo Sandoval Sarabia, José Ángel Martínez Hernández, Juan Marcos Guzmán. Teacher, sorry, did you hear me? Yes, I did. Uh, okay. Thank yes. you. Thank you. Teacher, sorry. Sí. I'm Carolina. here, Carolina. Yep. Thank you, Carolina. Thank you. Here comes Miguel, too. How are you guys? How was your day today? Good, thank you. What about you? It's a little bit Friday. Busy. Yeah, yeah. It's Friday 13. It was a good day because today was a, today is a payday. Today was payday, yeah. The only good thing is that today was a payday. Yeah. And we're alive, of course. Nowadays, being alive is a, is a it's a privilege to be alive. Come on. Okay, okay. 
So it's Friday. Um, who's resting tomorrow? Who's resting tomorrow? Nobody's so lucky. Nobody's unlucky. I, I am resting, but that for me is not being lucky. That's <laughs> that's bad. I need I need another job on weekends. I'm without hours on weekend and I need more hours. Yeah. Guys, if you can, please turn on your camera, okay? If you can. Let's start the class. Okay, what do you remember about yesterday? What do you remember about yesterday? Okay, let me clarify something. Let me take advantage of this four minutes. I have four minutes right now. Um, let's talk about training solutions. I think we still have a little gap on training solutions. There are different types of um, trainings that you can have. The most common one, and I wouldn't call it a training, and is a one-on-one -on -one session. One-on-one -on -one session is your boss and you, just the two of you, uh, your trainer and you. Okay, that's a one-on-one -on -one training, but it's more to provide feedback about your job, about how you feel, you know, personal matters. That's why it is called a one-on-one -on -one session, one-on-one -on -one session, one-to-one, -one. okay? Uh, another type of training um, solution or training um, approach, a training approach, I will call it, is um, on-the-job training, which is hands-on-the-job, you know. In some jobs, they still do this, and this is, Oh my God, it's raining. Okay. And this is very common in El Salvador in many companies to have a, an on-the-job training. It's like they train you doing, doing what you will do. They train you next to someone when you're going to use your hands, right? Okay. We said mentoring. Mentoring is more like basically the same, but you see someone doing something, then this person guides you step by step on how to do things, okay? Then we have the short-term trainings, which are, could be just a few hours on training with a group of people, okay? It could be um, a week, but after a week, it's a long training, okay? It's considered a long-term training, and it could be a month, two months. Okay, now after the training, there is a period where you are allowed, you're allowed to make mistakes. Do you understand that? Yes. Okay, how do we call it, Jocelyn, in the call center environment? Mm. Let me see. I didn't remember. That is, that is just for three months that you can uh, make an A and error, but you are learning. Or you can take longer doing the tasks, performing the tasks. Yes. Yeah. Mm -hmm. uh, you can have a back PA or back performance during these months because supposedly you are, you are a new one. So how, do you, how do you call these you people? Learning, but later, After. no. After nesting, you say? Sorry? Yes, nesting. We call it yes, in the nesting. call center industry, we call it nesting. The nesting period, you know what is a nest? Yeah. Everybody? Sandra, uh, Ada, Johnny, Fatima? No. Not me. <laughs> Not me. <laughs> you say Not it. Me. Not me. Not me. Good. Okay, nest is oh. where, where the birds where the birds put their eggs, where yeah. the birds put their <laughs> little eggs, you know, and they oh, take care of really? the eggs. <laughs> but really? Really? Yeah. Uh, nido. Nido, thank you. Yeah, a nido. It's uh, the action, right? Uh-huh. When they burn. Uh, Again, Jenny? 
what's the meaning that the action that the action? Uh, when when the egg breaks. Uh, can you write it, Alexander, on the chat? Uh, yeah, and so nesting is like okay. that period. Not nesting. Nesting is is a term is a term that we use in the call center industry to refer to people who is just learning. You know, they are still making mistakes. They still have some gaps to correct. Okay, and and that usually is one month, two months, three months, the most. Okay, not that much, but you have your supervisor next to you. You can make questions, and after the nesting period, uh oh. You cannot say uh oh anymore. Is, okay, okay. That is a period of time that led you to commit a mistake. Mm -hmm. Yeah. And in the regular industry, let's say in regular jobs, office jobs, there is a nesting period. By law, by law, you have 90 days as well, 30 days. I mean, 90 days, uh, three months where you are under probation, under probation. And if you make a mistake, then it's okay, you know, but after three months, your boss needs to think about it. Your boss can still think about it and say, hey, you know what, mm, I'm sorry, but no, we are, you're not good for this job. Or you know what, let me move you to another position. Okay, within three months, okay. Okay, or although it depends on your position, right? Because Ada cannot make a mistake, <laughs> right? It's like, oops, <laughs> oops, <laughs> no. <laughs> okay, <laughs> that's difficult. Did you have a nesting period, Ada? Hello? Did you have a nesting period? Tuvo un periodo de prueba? No. As a surgeon? No. No, you just oh, <laughs> see? hands on the job. Okay, it's uh <laughs> practice yeah. years, I believe. No, okay, go ahead. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, that's 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 gotta be really tough to be a surgeon. Is have you seen Gray's Anatomy? Yeah, yeah, that's nice. Yeah. My god, mm. yeah, that's crazy, right? Okay. So, Fene <laughs> was giving us a tour. <laughs> oh my God, I saw your whole house right here. <laughs> Sorry, did you say? It's okay, yeah. I know yeah. you're, you're just arriving home. <laughs> okay. Good, good. Hey, nice, nice, nice biceps. Or how do you call this? Um, <laughs> yeah, nice, man. Good job. Yeah. <laughs> I have five, five, five days already. Yeah. <laughs> I feel oh. awesome. I feel awesome right now. It doesn't hurt anymore. Yeah. That's awesome. Okay, guys, let's do it. Let's start. Today's lesson is about the future with Will. Let's get back there. Okay, so it's 810. As we said before, we must go through the grammar. You know what? I need your help. I don't want to talk today. I'm not going to talk. You are going to talk. So let me select someone. Johnny. Great. OK, I want you to explain to the class, how do you make a positive sentence with will? All yours. Uh, I explain. Okay, uh, 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 positive sentence, uh, the structure is uh, the subject will and the verb and complement and uses for something that you can do it, you you. Could do it. Um, that's uh, I don't know. <laughs> You're <laughs> right. <laughs> look, look at the explanation. Use will to make 
or you're fine. Go ahead. Explain to the or, class. Uh, or we can uh, make a, a, a how, you, how you say prediction. Yeah, there you go. Use and, will to make predictions to say and something general that read it. Use will to make predictions to say. Okay, to so say uh -huh, what you believe will happen in the future is what you believe is not something certain, you know, that you're sure that it's going to happen. And you use going to, right? If you're sure that's going to happen, you say, I am going to. I think a famous chef that's is good. going to come to the event. But if you are not a hundred percent sure, you can use will. Teacher, okay. what is the subject here? A famous sub, a famous chef, right? I think it's just an expression. I think uh, I think a famous chef, a famous chef is the subject. Okay. So again, Jenny, we have a subject, will, the verb on its base form and the complement. And that's a positive sentence. Very good. Okay, let me see Sandrita. Can you explain a negative sentence or how do you make negative this sentence? Any, any of the sentences? Okay, Carolina. For negative sense. Oh. oh, I thought she didn't hear us. Sandra, perdón, pensé que no me había escuchado. Oh. Okay, Sandra, can you explain a negative sentence? And then Sandra, Carolina is going to explain the question. Mm -hmm. Okay, I will not uh, play soccer. Okay, so what's the structure? You need a subject. Mm -hmm. Okay. Play soccer, a subject. Mm. No. Okay, so the okay. subject, I. I is the subject, right? Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. See, sorry. It's okay. I is a subject. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Will, there. Uh, will and uh, not. Will and not see a bird and complement play soccer. Mm -hmm. So I subject want or will not. Ah, okay. okay, is the auxiliary in negative. Then I have play, which is the verb, and then the complement. Okay. Okay, simple. Subject, Thanks. want, verb in a space form. Don't forget a space form and the complement. Okay, Carolina, can you explain a question using will? About questions, we, we can use uh, the, the word will plus subject, um, the verb, Base verb mm -hmm. plus complement. That's it. Who can tell me how do you make an open question, a WH question? WH. Mm. Add WH question as first, then auxiliary plus subject plus verb in base form plus complement plus question mark. You got it. As simple as that. So how many are we? We are 16 now, so let me split you for a minute. We're going to do two things. Number one, I need you to complete these sentences using will. Let me just double check what I'm saying here. Yep, up, up, up. exercise five. 
H37, yes, okay. So let's complete the exercise five. I will send it to your WhatsApp right now on page 37. But I want you to challenge your classmate as well. So for example, I mean, do an example really quick, okay? I say positive, Rene says negative, and Johnny says the question. Sandra will make the open question, okay? So I will take a shower tomorrow. I will take a shower tomorrow morning. I will take a shower tomorrow morning. Rene, negative. Uh, uh... Same sentence. I, I, sentence. I will. I, I will him. No, I will him. I want take a shower. I want. Sorry. I want take a shower tomorrow. Morning. Okay, Johnny. The or question. Sure. So I said I will take a shower tomorrow. Rene said I won't take a shower tomorrow morning. What's the question, Yuri? What will it? No, what will it? No, 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 no. What will it? Toda regla gramatical, el auxiliar se trae al principio para hacer una pregunta cerrada, una pregunta yes or no. Una yes, no question. Sí, el auxiliar se trae al principio para hacer una pregunta cerrada. So, Johnny. I will take a shower tomorrow morning. I won't take a shower tomorrow morning. Will I take a shower? Will I take a shower? Will I take a shower tomorrow morning? Okay, Sandra, el, el, aquí es el reto. Sandra, WH question. WH question. Mm -hmm. La misma oración, eh? Mm -hmm. Ah, la misma Está fácil. Solo hay que agregarle la WH al principio. I will take a shower tomorrow morning. I won't take a shower tomorrow morning. Will I take a shower tomorrow morning? When you take. When you take. When. When you will. Take a shower. Shower. Let's see. When I take a shower tomorrow. Okay, decía Alexander que si se hace una cerrada. Y decía Alexander que la WH se agrega antes del auxiliar. Ok. Pero, y esto, ojo, con toda regla gramatical te va a pasar. Lo más lógico, ¿qué sería? Preguntar el cuándo. Pero el cuándo, yeah. el cuándo ya está dentro de la pregunta. Lo quiero decir en español para que quedemos claros en esto. Ok, si quiero saber, ajá, podría preguntar dónde. Where, tan fácil como esto. Will. Where will ah. I take a shower tomorrow morning? Se arruinó la ducha. Where will I take a shower tomorrow morning? ¿Dónde me voy a bañar mañana? ¿Dónde me bañaré mañana, perdón? Ojo, ¿dónde me bañaré mañana? En la mañana. Um, pero si yo quiero preguntar ¿cuándo? ¿tendría sentido que dijese when, esto? ¿when will I no. take a shower morning? no no, ¿verdad? o uh, oh, when uh, hours tendría que maybe when I'm ojo when will I take a shower ahí sí porque no estoy yes. especificando el tomorrow morning ok Quiero saber um, a qué horas, a ver. Uh, what time what I will time? take a shower. Ok, ojo, okay. eso hasta le pasa a gente que aprendió inglés acá en academias y, y este, pues lo he visto, ¿no? Ese, esa preposición iría antes, eh, Josie. Sería what time. What time, yes. What time will I take a shower tomorrow? Podría ser todavía. Ok, pero el morning no. What time will I take a shower tomorrow? A qué horas tomaré la ducha mañana? Take a shower tomorrow. Ok, in this case, teacher, 
I I learned the same thing at what time? But this is it's is wrong. Actually. Sí, fíjate que yo igual yo solía decir at what time. Pero en los últimos cinco años he entendido que no. No está bien hecho. De hecho, y lo digo porque muchos americanos no hacen eso. Un 90% de los americanos dicen at what time? At what time? So they say what time? What time are you? What time okay. you come? What time are you going to come? Okay? Okay. okay. Good. So, ojo, repito, y estoy diciendo en español porque yo sé, eso es un poco confuso a veces, cuando pasas de una pregunta cerrada a una abierta, y como la regla dice, que solo hay que agregar una WH antes del will, ok, esto te puede confundir y puedes cometer ese error sencillo de, la respuesta a veces ya está en la pregunta cerrada, ese es el punto, ojo con eso. Y número dos, hay palabras complementarias dentro de la WH, es decir, mi WH es esta. What time? Okay, what time? Si te digo how often? Okay, how much? Todo eso, ese much, ese often, okay, ese many, todo eso son preguntas, palabras complementarias de las WH. Okay, so you accept the challenge. So we have two jobs right now. Let's complete the exercise on page 37 and exercise five. And let's challenge our classmates. Just the way I did, throw, just throw a positive and say, Jocelyn, and say, René, okay, got it? La siguiente persona tiene que saber que va en negativo o el positivo, okay? Sin estar diciendo, no, 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 yo la negativa, no, yo la pregunta, nah. Just go for it, okay? Okay, let's practice, guys. Questions, no? Okay, let's go. No problem. Okay. Uh, okay. Okay. We have to complete the sentence. Okay. Mm, sure, you will have a good time. The second. I'm sure you will sure have. You will have a long time on the train. I'm sure you will have a good time of the training. That will be the number two. Yeah. And the number three, the training needs analysis. The training needs analyzing. The training needs analyzing. The training yeah. needs analyze will be. Will be. Assessment. Training needs analyzing. And the number four. I need four months. I will. My best to get the good score in this evaluation. I will do my best to get a good score. Or in evaluation. Number five. She won't, she won't be 
late to the meeting. Meeting. Um, number six. The manager. Will work. Work to help us provide. How long? How long will I will I watch TV tomorrow? Hmm? Yes. How long or what time? What time? Two, maybe. Uh -huh. Okay. You start uh, affirmative, positive. Um. Whatever. Uh, you will. You will go outside with your friends. You will, you will go, go up. outside with your friends. Go out, go outside with your friends. Okay. Will no. Um. You Negative. want. Uh -huh. You want. You want go out. Uh, inside. Oh, out. Outside. Ah, yeah. Out. You want go outside with my friends? Yes. Yes. Where? Uh, no. Uh, Is that question? The question. Uh, will Will you go outside with your friends? Yes. When 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 will you go out go outside with your friends? Mm -hmm. Okay. Yes. <laughs> okay. Next. Did you complete the exercise on page thirty-seven? Yes. yes. Okay, good. Continue, continue. <laughs> it just says I is she the manager. The manager will work hard to help how to help me improve. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Get Mm -hmm. Okay. Teacher, only complete the sentence. Okay, so first you have to complete the chart on page 37. And then you need to um, challenge your classmate. Make a positive sentence. And then the next person makes a negative sentence, the same sentence, but in negative. And then the next person does a question mm -hmm. and so on. Okay. Number four is I promise. Mm Can hear you. 
Sandra, you? Okay. Yeah, possible. So. I will I will study English um, tomorrow. Okay, I will study English tomorrow. What would be the negative? I I want I want to study English. I want to study English tomorrow. Uh huh. Um, the sentence is, um, will I, will I, yeah, will I study? Will I study English tomorrow? Now, what is the WH question? Well, where where will I study? Where will I study English tomorrow? That's right. Where will I study English tomorrow? Very good. Okay. Make more make more sentences. That's the whole point. Okay. Next sentence. Me. <laughs> the teacher is on the house. <laughs> In the house. Teacher. In the house. Not, nothing bad, nothing good, all good. Everything blue. All blue. Actually, being blue is being sad. Yeah. <laughs> Yellow. Friday, Yellow is the color of the sun. <laughs> <laughs> okay, mm -hmm. what do you think about we are practice practicing? Um, she yeah, will we... drop she will okay. drop her kid at the school. She will drop <laughs> off. Drop off. Okay. Drop off. Drop off her kids at the school. Mm-hmm. She will not drop off. She will take their kids. Her kids. Okay. Her kids. Her kids. I always, I always ask because that, it's a positive city. They or her. Her. Because teacher. it's a teacher. <laughs> mm -hmm. They or her kids. Her kids. Her kids. It could be their kids if you had the couple in front of you, right? Ah, okay. If you don't see, then you have to use it. Oh, they are not, not near to the, the boy. Okay. Uh, remember, it's just about making positive, negative question an open question so give it a try i want to hear you okay she will draw off her kid at the school she will not drop off her kid at the school will she drop off her kid at the school drop off you're saying or drive off drop off drop off right okay drop off at the school uh -huh. Why she will drop off the, her kid at the school? Which is a common mistake. Why will she? Hmm? Why? When? Where? No, it's okay. Why will she drop off her kids at school? But you, remember, why will? You said why, why she will drop. <laughs> it's the opposite. Why, why will she? Drop off their their kids at the school. Their kids at school. Okay. 
another one. Okay. Come on. I will, well, I will travel to Guatemala. I will not travel to Guatemala. Will I travel to Guatemala? Will she travel? <laughs> will, I, will I? Will I travel to Guatemala? Okay. Will I travel to Guatemala? When will she travel to Guatemala? Okay. It's easy. It's easy. Yes. It's of cake. <laughs> of course. Alexander knows a lot. Alexander knows a lot, but it's still making mistakes. <laughs> That's the whole point, guys. You have to practice until you get it yeah, right yeah. without mistakes. Yeah, it looks okay. good. Okay. Oh. Keep going. Keep going. Don't don't let okay. it go until you perfectionate things. That's the whole point. Okay. Great. Perfect. Wait. Uh -huh. Mm -hmm. You will stay home the next week. I will I will fly uh no fly no yeah. it's travel yeah. it's travel uh -huh. uh, uh other countries. To another country. I will travel. Another country. I, I will, will travel, travel to another country. To another country. Mm -hmm. I won't travel to another country. I won't. Not. I want or I will not, Rene. O digo, uh -huh. I want okay. or digo, I will I not. The one or will not travel. Okay. Cualquiera de las dos, pero solo una. Right. Mm -hmm. Okay. Uh, we what we, will where uh -huh. will you travel? Uh, where will you travel? Will travel? Will you travel? Another travel? country. To another country. Oh, where mm -hmm. will you travel? La respuesta sería to another country. Where will? Mm -hmm. Where or will you travel? Mm -hmm. To Australia. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Oh, Mexico. Where will? <laughs> it's a beautiful <laughs> country. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Many, many beautiful countries. Okay, keep going. Yeah. More examples. Come on, come on, come on. You're only missing two I minutes. Will, um, two minutes. I will help prepare the dinner. I will help preparing the dinner. I will help preparing I the dinner. I, 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 I will not. I will not help prepare dinner. Preparing mm -hmm. dinner. Uh huh. Mm -hmm. No. What will what will help prepare dinner? Mm. No, no. What will no? What will will dinner? I, no. Ha, no. What will prepare help. dinner? No. No. What will you help with? What would you prepare your dinner? Uh, mm. uh huh. Isela, another way. Why will you prepare the dinner if you can uh, buy it? Cook. If you can cook. Yeah. Okay. Okay. <laughs> if you can cook, if you can cook. You can cook. cook. Hey, that, that's, that could be confusing, right? I will help preparing mm -hmm. dinner. I won't yeah. help preparing the dinner. Okay. Will I help preparing the dinner? What will you help with? Uh, what will you help? Mm -hmm. Oh, preparing the dinner. dinner. Got uh, it. Okay, good. let's go okay. back.
Okay, go ahead. Can you translate this to English and make negative question, open question? I will tell you the truth. Thank you, Isela and Jocelyn. I will tell you the truth. Saber que verdad. Okay, negative. <laughs> I will not tell you that the truth. Okay, let's try to use the contraction that's more common. I won't I won't tell I won't tell you the truth. The truth, okay? Continue. How do you do the question? Yes or no question? Well, well, no. Well. Why not? I tell you how do you make an open question? Well, where will? Why will I tell you the truth? Uh -huh. Okay. Mm -hmm. Why will I tell you the truth? Where will I tell you the when. truth? When, when, when will I tell you the truth? What if I want to use what? Can uh, I do it? Yes. Why would I tell you the truth? What truth? What? What? Mm -hmm. what? Come on, intermediate to people. You. Why will? No. Why will I tell you? What, what will what I, will tell you? I tell you? What will, what will I tell you? What will I tell you? The truth. The truth. Yeah. The truth. Okay. <laughs> okay. Uh, I heard which. Okay. Can you use which? Wait, wait, Alex. Wait, Alex. Which will I which tell truth, you? Which truth would I tell you? What? Which truth will, will, which truth would I, will, will I, I tell you? What? Tell you. ¿Cuál verdad te diré? Mm. ¿Cuál? Mm. Son varias verdades. <laughs> ok. Ahora, ahí es donde tú vienes y formas una palabra complementaria con la WH. What, which truth, which route, which voice, which animal? Remember, which is for options. Okay, which truth will I tell you? Okay. Hmm. The same will happen if I say whose. Do you remember whose? Oops. Whose? Who? Yeah. Don't pay attention to that. Which? Um, so we said, which truth will I tell you? The same happens if I say, whose, whose truth will I tell you? La verdad de quien te diré? Tu verdad, mi verdad, la de él. Okay, whose truth will I tell you? And so on, okay? Just think about it, make exercises. A este punto ya tenés que hacer, um, Mucho sinónimo, digamos, en tu mente, ¿sí? Diferentes maneras de decir las cosas. Ya tenés que ir entendiendo que en inglés no solo se dice una, una forma, únicamente las cosas. No todo está escrito en piedra. Puedes hacer de mil maneras to hablar o to grammar. Ok, so let's go really quick with this. Don't worry. I will show you how to process a credit card payment. I'm sure you... Will... You, you will have a good time at the training easy. The training needs analysis. Will, will be a success. Will be. Hmm. Hmm. No me gusta esta oración. The training yeah. needs analysis, comma. It will be a success, maybe. It's wrong. Okay. I promise I... We'll do. we'll do my best. Okay. 
She will not. Will not. Mm -hmm. She will not or she won't uh -huh. be late to the meeting. Okay. The manager will work. Simple. It was easy. Okay. As per your lesson plan, let's move on to the next two simple questions. Okay. Um, so, what will you do if you can't afford to give time? a way to your employees to receive training. Do you think online courses are a good alternative option? What would you do if you can't afford to give time away to your employees to receive training? Okay, uh, if you understand what this word means, what does afford means, can you give me synonyms for afford? No Spanish. Um, like a rich. Like rich. Um, okay. Hey, says rich. It's like I com accomplish. Accomplish. Um, accomplish. Accomplish. To get a to get a goal or something like that, something that you can, as I said before, that you can reach. Achieve. Achieve. Yeah, that is the word. You can achieve something you can achieve. Mm. Hmm. Hmm. This is another word, but it's a little bit queer. A little bit what? Uh, C A S E I Z E. This. I believe. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Okay. Just listen. Oh. Z, 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 reach, accomplish, achieve, Z. Okay, um, this is more to achieve something, but to afford implies if you can or not have that thing. Be realistic. Can you I pay? Hope. Can you pay the price for something? Do you have enough money? And in this context, do you have time for your employees? Time means money, right? So what would you do if you can't afford to give time away to your employees to receive training? You cannot afford, you cannot afford to give time away because if you give them time away to receive the training you lose money okay yeah. so let me see if the concept is clear um carla janet can you afford a ferrari no i can't you can't okay you got it okay sandra elizabeth can you afford can you afford a new house? Can you afford, sorry? A new house in Santa Elena? No, I can't. You can't, really. <laughs> I can't. I can't afford a new house in Santa Elena. Ada Susana, can you afford, can you afford a new pair of shoes? Yes, I can. <laughs> you can afford it, right? Yes, why not? Okay, you got it, right? Fatima, can you afford, can you afford inviting me to an ice cream? Can you afford inviting me to an ice cream? Yes. Yes, right? It's not expensive. Yes, but not from Pops. <laughs> Too expensive. <laughs> Let's go to Sarita. Okay. Or to La Nebria. Okay, you got it, right? What's the meaning of afford in Spanish? Permitirse. Ajá. Y ahí está lo complejo. Esa palabra no tiene una traducción exacta al español. Salvo que, a ver, alguien que le meta en el traductor, ¿qué le sale? 
Poder pagar. Pagar, poder pagar. Regalar. Poder pagar, regalar, poder pagar, poder pagar relagar, regalar, mm -hmm. perdón, permitirse. Okay. And, and the, uh -huh. same, the same will happen to you with other words like struggle. Okay. Struggle. The struggle is real, sister. Mm -hmm. Struggle. I'm struggling with economy. You struggle with economy. You struggle with your boss every day. You struggle with your job every day. You see? What's the what's the, the straight meaning of struggle? Como luchar por algo. Luchar. No por algo. Y ese es el problema. Oh. Luchar. La lucha. Deal. La lucha. Deal with something. Okay, struggle oh. with something, deal with That's something. Manejar, deal. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. You got it. Okay, so if we got the concepts, let's go with the questions. What will you do if you can afford to give time away to your employees to receive training? Do you think online courses are a good alternative option? What do you think? To give a training, is it a good option? Online trainings? Yeah, of course. Why? Because in this current pandemic, this is the best option. Well, yeah, with the pandemic, we have proven that online trainings are a good option, right? And they're affordable. They are, oh, new word, affordable. What a, oh. Translate that. I don't know how to translate that to Spanish. Affordable. Not typing, oh my god. Okay, w affordable. The double A what? Affordable F. Double F, did I? Yeah. Mm. Affordable. Okay. Is it allowed? I mean, can you handle it? That's another way of saying it. Can you handle it? Can you take it? Can we take the heat? In the company, you can say, can we afford it? Can we take the heat? Can we handle it? Okay, so affordable. Is it handleable? And so on, we will see that later. Okay, so online courses, they're a good alternative option after the pandemic, we're proving that yes, they're a good option. We're going to discuss these two questions in groups. Um, that's what we have to do next. Discuss about online courses. What online courses can you take or you would like to take if you had the opportunity? So let me do the attendance before we go on small groups and have this conversation. Ada Susana Cáceres Mendoza. Present, teacher. Please turn on your cameras, everybody. Alexander de Jesús Sánchez Soto. Present. Carla Ivania Cabrera Serrano. Present. Thank you. Claudia Maricela Solano Crespín. Elvin Arcides Eguizabal Martínez. Elvin, oh, I see Present. you. Thank you. Thank you. Fátima Ifegenia López Ramos. Present. Fernando Ernesto Cosme Morales. Fernando was not here today. Chinote. Isela Liliana Miranda Espinosa. Present. Thank you. Jose Antonio Cubillas Hernandez. Carla Yanet Amaya Herrera. Present teacher. Miguel Ángel Paz Landa Verde. Miguel Ángel was around here. Yeah, I can see him. Yeah, present. Okay. Miriam Carolina Mozo Valdez. Present. René Alfonso Madrid Escalante. Present. Rina Marisabel Álvarez de Chávez. Present. Roberto Luis Oma Ubaña Orellana. Está. Ok. Sabrina Mabel Latín Castro. Sabrina, not here. Ok. Ok. Sandra Elizabeth Osorto Romero. Present. William Alexander Ramirez Flores. William is not among us today. Jocelyn Imelda Rivas Abarca. Present. Alan Christopher Abrego Thank you. Thank you. Yes, Jocelyn, I got you. 
Carolina Ivette Romero Avelino. Okay. Present. Johnny Vladimir Portillo Chávez. Present. José Alfredo Sandoval Sarabia. José Ángel Martínez Hernández. Juan Marcos Guzmán. Not here today. Okay. Wow, we are 17 today. Okay, let's move it. I'm going to split you and send you these questions to your WhatsApp. Talk. Talk, 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 talk. Okay. Let's go. Thank you. Uh, Jocelyn, Tell what me. would you do if you can't afford to you give time afford. away to your employees to receive training? Mm, I will look the option to afford in a training if they need it. I will try to look for a resolution. Okay. Do you think online courses are a good alternative option? Hola. Did you hear problems with the connection? Yes. Yes, are a good alternative nowadays uh, because of the COVID-19, we are uh, just learning online mm -hmm. everything. So in this case, uh, you can have the training, not online, but how do you say presencial, teacher? Live. Live. Yes. Yes. Ok, entonces contestar las... Ok, as you can see, the, first, the first question, mm -hmm. the first question goes with would. Mm -hmm. Ok, what would yes, you do if you can't afford to give away to give time away to your employees to receive training so i would mm -hmm. i will think of other options i would decide to do the training another time maybe mm -hmm. okay what will you do i will take them in pairs okay okay um okay so can I, what will do you if you can afford to give time and work to your employees to receive training? Uh, I, I will program, uh, for example, Excel mm -hmm. in the employees. Excellent, okay. Yes, I will learn English. I will learn a, a different course online. Okay. Rina, uh, ¿que se puede quedar después de la clase? Diez minutos? Sí, teacher. Okay. Thank you very much. Keep going, guys. Keep going. Okay. I think it is a good idea. Um. 
Okay, the first question is, the first question is with wood. Okay, so how do you answer a question with wood? Yeah, I think that she's now nervous because we are here. <laughs> oh, come on. Okay, let me try doing something here. Okay, I'm not here. <laughs> it's almost the same, but do you want to try, Carla? Um, you already you already know the meaning of that question in Spanish, so since you already know that, uh, try to express your ideas once again, but on this time on English. You already got it, just, just try to do it on English. Okay. Um. Buscarían formas para poderles transmitir la información. Okay. Um, okay, and now, don't, and now try to do it in English. Okay. You already know the, the basic words. So I think that you can try to do it. I look, I look, I look. Sorry. I look um, information. Okay. Um, the teacher is not here. Don't worry, he's not listening. Okay. Um, Try, I know that you can try it. Okay, um, and take your time to organize your ideas. You already know the meaning in Spanish and you already know what, what you have to say, but just try to do it in English. During this time, I think that we can uh, hear Miriam. Uh, in my case, I would look for training alternative hopes outside the old working hours. I don't believe this appear. I don't believe this appear the, the pandemic because the old, the, the how you say, you see. Uh, the virus, virus mm. is mutating and changing. Um, mm. So the people that that's, that find uh, that something that can stop the pro propagation, mm. that's always will be. <laughs> Do your job is in the house? No. no. Okay. I work in the company. Oh. Do you have a meeting in the world? Or oh. online? Uh, Face to face on. You have but problem the, with connection, Johnny. Uh, 
Yeah, I have problem with my coordination. It's mm -hmm. unstable. It's a, it's a difficult online <laughs> training. Yeah. Yes. <laughs> yes. You don't concentrate like <laughs> live. <laughs> okay. But I uh, can tell you if the pandemic is going to disappear in I hope long. A home long. Mm -hmm. mm, depends. Long. Yes. Depends. Yeah, depends. For the position for the um the the control the sanitation. For the people, is a uh, and back vacuum. It's a vacuum. 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 Mm -hmm. the vaccine. Ba vaccine. Okay. It's a. Uh, it's a. Um, it's a probably the contagious. Contagious. Okay. Contagious. Um. And the control, the control, the, the sanitation for the uh, the people. Ada, could it no? Could it be that vaccine are not effective? Oh. Maybe. No, uh, so so is a is a, a lot of the the um, commentaries. It's a lot of commentaries and comments. There's a lot of comments. A lot of comments is a uh, depend the um the um, estado inmunológico de pacientes. <laughs> Mm -hmm. O sea, depende de 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 people, o sea, de um, o sea, va a, va a depender mucho de la estado inmunológico y de enfermedades complementarias o crónicas. Pero sí está teniendo buenos resultados. No, no translate the English. <laughs> and you, Sandra, what are you feeling? Do you feel that again, please, uh, Johnny? And do you think that uh, Okay. Hello. Rowling. Yeah, he got stuck. Hey, Johnny. The connection. The connection. Okay. My connection is bad. It's Let's difficult go. on light. It Okay, um, so, entre más vamos avanzando, más difícil se va volviendo los temas, ¿verdad? Okay. 
challenging. More challenging. Okay. Okay, ahora solo recuerden que con lo que se me pregunta es con lo que contesto. So, ¿qué tal si en lugar de decir, what would you do if you can't afford to give time away to your employees to receive training? You can find other questions with similar structure. What will you do if you can't afford, if you can afford your house? What will you do if you can't afford your house? The rent. I will try to to get a, a boat. Alone. Alone. Alone mm -hmm. to a form. But if you can't afford your house, it means that you can't afford another loan. I would rent. Okay. Meanwhile. You will rent meanwhile. Okay. Hmm. What would you do if you can't afford a car? I would. I, mm -hmm. Someone else? Uh, I would huh? take a bus. <laughs> uh -huh. Ada, Ada, I would. I will take the bus. So, la pregunta oh. es, so, como dice, what would you do? ¿Qué harías? ¿Qué harías? If well, you can, my job. <laughs> I, will, I will work extra hours, overtime. I will do overtime. Okay, it could be an option. Okay. So, always try to practice with what you get. Okay. Don't think that everything is difficult. Dejen de pensar que las cosas son difíciles. Todo se puede. Solo hay que fijarse en la estructura que lleva cada cosa. Okay. So we have a small conversation now to move on with the class. And I'll read it once for you. And then I'll select some of you to practice. Okay. As usual. So I'll just go ahead and read it. It says, I'm having a training next week. But I have to travel to another city. Sounds like you will be busy. I'm taking an e-learning training on kitchen safety procedures this weekend, but I can take it from home. Cool. I will ask for e-learning options next time. Yeah, look at the time. I'm meeting some friends at a, at a conference tonight. See you later. And again, most difficult part of this lecture. I'm taking an e-learning training on kitchen safety procedures this weekend. I'm taking an e-learning training on kitchen safety procedures this weekend. Hmm, can you do it? So I need two volunteers. Me, me, Carla. Okay, me, Carla, and me, who? Yeah. Ada. Me, Ada. Okay, me, Ada, and me, Carla. One, two, three, action. I have a training next week, but I have to travel to another city. Sounds like you will be busy. I'm taking an e-learning training on kitchen safe, safety procedures this weekend, but I can take it from home. Cool. I will ask for a learning option next time. Yeah. Look at the time. I'm meeting some friends at a conference tonight. See you later. Easy, right? Okay. Come on, Ella. Um, I'm um, having. I'm having. There you go. Okay. Next, e-learning, Ada. E-learning. E-learning options. E-learning option. Op op option next time. Options. Options. Op options. Better. Options. 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 <laughs> there you go. Okay. I'm meeting some friends, Carla. I'm meeting some friends. 
I'm meeting some friends. I'm meeting some friends. I'm meeting some friends. Better. Some friends. A lot better. Thank you. Okay. Another couple. One more couple. One more time. Do I want to try. How much I love you. Alexander? Okay. Yeah. Let's go with Fatima. Mm. Yay. Let's go. Okay. Alex, you're Felix. Okay. I'm having, sorry, I was talking in mute. <laughs> I'm not having a training next week, but I have to travel to another city. So, like you will be busy, I take it. I'm in learning training of kitchen safety procedures this week, but can be from home. Cool. I will ask for e learning option next time. Yeah, <laughs> time. I am meeting. Some friends on the conference tonight. See you later. Good, Fatima. Better. Let's just re make sure we read carefully this weekend, but I can take it from home. Repeat this weekend, but I'm taking it. I'm sorry, this weekend, but I can take it from home. This weekend, by but I taking is <laughs> but I can take it from home. But I can take it from home. Better. Okay, and that's the whole purpose of this conversation for you to practice and repeat, 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 repeat. Then I'll bring you back and split you again. Please make sure you repeat, repeat, repeat. Okay, let's do it. Uh, okay. The screen. Uh, no. Oh, I'm ready. Okay. In the chat. Okay. okay. You are Felix. Mm -hmm. Bien. You first? No, you, you. You are Felix. Ah, okay. Okay. I am having a training next week, but it have to travel to another city. Sounds like you will be busy. I'm taking an e-learning training on kitchen safety procedures this weekend, but I can but I can take it from home. Uh -huh. Cool. We last for lading option next time. <clears throat> Yeah, look at the time. I'm meeting some friends at a conference tonight. See you later. Yeah. Change. Okay. Friends. Mm -hmm. Hola. Miriam, Miriam, no. No sé, si, ahí está Miriam. Ah, eh, no sé si escucha Miriam. Bueno, no. Okay. Digamos, I, <coughs> I'm... I'm having a training next week, but I have to travel to another city. So like yeah, look at the time. I'm meeting some friends at the conference tonight. See you later. Okay. Mm -hmm. Okay. Now I am Felix. <laughs> okay, who will be the lady? <laughs> Yes, I will share this screenshot. Okay. Okay. Uh -huh. I am having a training next week, but I had to travel to another city. Don't lie, you will be busy. I am taking an A learning training of the kitchen safety procedures this weekend, but I can but I can eat from home. Cool. I will ask for e learning options next time yeah look at the time admit i'm at the conference tonight 
See you later. See you later. Am, okay. I am okay. Felix. I'm having a train. But I have to travel to another city. Sounds like you will be bus busy. <laughs> I am taking an ear learning training on kitchen safely. Safety. Procedures. Safety. Safety. Mm -hmm. Can you repeat the shirt, please? Sorry. Safety. Safety. Yep. I am safety. training on kitchen safety. Okay, Procedure. look at me. Safety. I cannot see you. I have an issue with my internet. I cannot see you, but I will try. On kitchen, could you repeat again? Safety. 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 Mm -hmm. On kitchen, Better. safety. Procedures this weekend, but I can take it from home. Cool. I will ask for a learning option next time. Yeah. Look at the time. I am meeting some friends at the conference tonight. See you later. See you later. Mm -hmm. Okay. Hey. Carolina. Then with me. Okay. <laughs> I'm, I'm having a take it from home. You can link those. It sounds better and the teacher don't text you if some words. Come again, I'm sorry. <laughs> no, no, <laughs> just practicing. <laughs> okay. Keep going. Okay. okay. I I having a try training next week, but I have to travel to another yeah. city. With the busy, um, taking a learning training of kitchen safety. I procedures this weekend, but I can take it from home. Good. We'll ask for a learning option next time. Yeah, look at the time. I made some friends at a conference. <laughs> Safety. 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 Sounds, sounds like you will be busy. Um, taking a, a learning training of kitchen safety safety procedures this weekend, but I can the but I can take from home. Cool. I will ask for e-learning options next time. Yeah, look at the time. Um, maybe some friends. Okay, good. So, yeah, you say busy. 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 You will be busy. I'm taking an e learning training. E learning training. E learning training. Y dijo lo demás super bien. De hecho, okay, so super good. Kit, uh, training on kitchen safety procedures this weekend, but I, as I dijo, but I can take it from home. Awesome. Okay. I'm meeting, I see, I'm meeting, no, I'm meeting, I'm meeting, I'm meeting. Repeat. I'm meeting. I'm meeting, I'm meeting some friends at a, at a, at a conference tonight. I'm meeting some friends at a conference tonight. I'm meeting some friends at a conference tonight. I'm at a conference tonight. At a conference tonight. See you later. Mm -hmm.
Hi. <laughs> Z, easy. It was simple. Let's go. Okay, let's move on. It was easy, right? So just think about some words that you may find difficult and don't forget always join the sounds but I but 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 whenever there's a T in the middle say but 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 I but I have but I have to travel to another city but I have to but I have to it sounds like you will be BC 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 I'm taking an e learning I'm taking an e I'm taking an e I'm taking an e I'm taking an e-learning training on kitchen safety procedures this weekend. But I, but I, but I, but I can take it from home. But I can take it from home. But I can take it from home. See? Cool. I will ask for e-learning options next time. Yeah. Look at the time. Yeah. Look at the time. I'm meeting some friends at a, at a, at a conference tonight. At a conference tonight. See you later. A este punto, tú tienes que irte fijando en esos sonidos que unen. Okay? Ante todo, cuidado con la T, la D, ¿ok? Y think twice, think twice. Hay palabras que son muy complejas en ese sentido, que te pueden causar dolor de cabeza, como escalera en inglés. Ladder, ladder. Y vas a escuchar que algunos teachers te dicen, no, se dice ladder, 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 ¿ok? And so on. You have some job to do. Look at the conversation and complete the sentences, okay? Mm -hmm. uh oh, okay. I, this is easy. And then you need to match the training solutions to their description. This is basically what we have been talking about. Of the shelf training courses, what? In-house training, shadowing. Mentoring. Okay, for some of you that work in call centers, this will be easy, but please let the others guess the topic. Okay, guess the idea. That's the whole point. And, and thank you very much, guys, for helping me when you're in teams. I love to see you helping your classmates. That's very useful. Thank you. So let's do two tasks. Number one, Look at the conversation and complete the sentences. This is easy. And then let's build vocabulary. Let's match the training solutions to their description. What is off the shelf training courses? Hmm. Okay, you have one, two, three, four options and four meanings, four uh, words, I'm sorry, that we need to identify. This is page 38, exercises three and four on your book. Yay. I'm so excited. I just can't hide it. Come on. I know, I know, I know, I know, I know. I want you. Let's go. Okay. Page. You can take on We're on page thirty-eight. Thirty-eight. Page. Three eight. Yes, thirty-eight exercises three and four. Mm -hmm. um, Look I at the will... conversation and complete the sentence. And having training next week and taking out e-learning i will ask for e-learning and i am meeting some friends <laughs> yeah um, i'm having yeah. i'm having training next week the conversation uh -huh. with and julia i'm taking um, um, e-learning training of different safety procedures I take so, in the second. The first uh, one and having. The second I'm, I'm taking. I take. I'm taking. 
and uh, in learning training. Taking a lady, training of fish and safe procedure. Three is I will ask for e learning option group time. And for I'm meeting. I will ask. Uh -huh. uh, and for I meet him. I will meet him. No, I meet him. I meet him. Meet him. Okay. Vocabulary building. Building. Uh -huh. It involves the plan one employees following another play or play shadow to learn to accept all the job. And what the employees following another play like shadow mm -hmm. leader and that is the job. This, this. Uh... So the first one, I'm having, I'm having a training next okay. week. The second one, mm -hmm. I, I, I'm I taking. Take it. Sorry. Uh, in the number four, let me see. Uh, it's some praying a conference. Number three, number three, will. Number, number three, I will ask, ask for the okay. learning option next time. Okay, and number four. Uh, number four, let me see. I. I'm. Uh, I'm meeting. I am meeting. Yeah. I am meeting some friend. Hmm. Oh. Hmm. I'm meeting. Okay. Next number uh, vocabulary building. You think number two is right? Number two. Uh huh. Um, I go on learning to. Taking. Yeah. So I like will be taking. Yeah, taking. <laughs> <laughs> Number two. Yeah, that's correct. I'm, I'm, ta I'm taking. Beautiful for you, please. As part of the induction. A ver. Okay. The first one is shadowing. Shadowing. one employee following another employee like a shadow to learn all the aspects of a job. This is especially strong for new employees in induction. Yes, shadowing. Okay. For generic courses, the staff will join employees from other business of the court. Some of these courses are designed to achieve or come toward a particular recognized qualification. Uh, this is of the chef training courses. It involves the informal transmission of knowledge and social capital over a period of time with some face to face meeting use. Okay, what do you think, Rina, Fatima? Of the shelf training courses. What, what is this? Huh? Sorry, teacher. Number one. <laughs> Number four. I didn't hear you. <laughs> <My husband>. <laughs> Cheaper. <laughs> I don't know. No, no, no. I was asking for uh, Rina and Fatima's opinion. Uh -huh. Informal transmission. Cheaper. Hmm. Yeah, that, cheaper. that number one is 
difficult, right? Off the shelf training courses in house training. Okay, keep going. Off the shelf training courses is the second one. Yeah. Hmm. Yes. Yes, it is. Hmm. Okay. Yes. It's the second one. Number one. Okay. Okay. Number so one is shadowing one. because mm -hmm. it's involved an employee for an employee uh -huh. blog. Okay. Vamos a seguir otro. O sea, vamos siguiendo. Como... Yeah, so the first one oh, for shadowing, shadowing is number three. It, it involves the informal transmission of knowledge and social capital mm -hmm. over a period of time with some face-to-face -face meetings. Use of no. email and telephone now. It is to this have- a mentoring. This is mentoring. Yeah. Mentoring. No, but, but um, okay. The first part that it says um, it involves one employee following one another employee like shadow tuner on the aspect of of a job. This is especially suitable suitable for new employees as a part of their induction. So mm -hmm. that part the I first think that should one. be yeah yes, should this be is shadowing, shadow. right? Okay. Shadow. Yeah. okay. We are looking for the the second one, right? Shipper mm. generic courses, the staff with young employees from other business. On the course. course. Some of these courses are designed to achieve or come towards a particular qualification. Mm. You say towards, 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 towards. 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 So sounds like a like a e in English. Towards. Towards. Mm -hmm. Towards. Mm -hmm. Um. Number one. Generic courses. Yeah. Of the shelf training course. Of the shelf training course. Training. Number one. And the other one is it, it involves it, it, it involves the yeah. informal transmission of knowledge and social capital over uh, capital number time. Number three is in house training, no. Mentoring. With some face. Yeah, it's mentoring. mentoring. Yes. Nice mentor. Mentoring. Yeah, the, 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 the key phrase, face-to-face -face meeting. They operate and to apply new knowledge in major culture. Training must be able to do this. I have the patience to teach or go. And the last one, it is... Is in-house, in-house training. Mm -hmm. Number four. It is a lot of people to learn in their own place and to apply the knowledge immediately. Training must be technically able to do the test. And have the patient to teach uh, or go Oh. Yeah. yeah. In-house training. Yeah, the last Teacher, day. I have a doubt. Mm -hmm. In this case, and to, to apply, you can use only and apply, or in this case, is well, to learn at their own place and to apply new knowledge and apply, yeah. Yeah, you can remove the preposition. Okay. Yeah, because of the connector that you're using, yes, you can remove the preposition. It sounds better. It allows people to learn at their own place and apply new knowledge immediately. Yeah. Okay. Thank you. Okay. Um... 
who is missing to read? Calibania. Okay. The, here is in bold. In goals. Number four. Sorry, my four doesn't work. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> in house training. Oui. No, it's in house training number two. Yeah. Always. Like this. Who is going to read? Carla. She has not read yet. Carla Ivani. Okay. Yeah. Change the color. Yeah, I am changing oh. the color for smart clear. And three, one, four, and two. Okay. Okay, excellent. Okay, let's go for once with the first example. Look at the conversation and complete the sentences. Number one is... I'm having a training next week. Easy, right? So that's present continuous. Okay, number two. I'm taking an e-learning training of kitchen safety procedure. Safety procedures, uh huh. Very good. Number three. I will ask for e learning option next time. Options. Options next time. Yeah. Okay. And number four. I'm meeting some friends at a conference tonight. Easy, very good. Okay, let's practice that. Uh, um, 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 there you go. Okay, now let's match the solutions to their description. Some of you were like even arguing <laughs> this part. So let's see, what is number one? It involves, it, 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 it involves one employee following another employee like a shadow to learn all the aspects of a job this is a specific i'm sorry especially this is especially suitable suitable for new employees as part of their induction what is it Shadowing, shadowing. Shadowing. Okay. So that will be number three. three. Okay. Got it. Number two. Cheaper genetic courses. The staff will join employees from other businesses on the course. Some of these courses are designed to achieve or count towards a particular particular recognized qualification a particular recognized qualification uh-huh yeah. one 
of the the shelf training one. of the shelf training courses. ¿Qué dice el público? Yes, it is. The number one. Yes. Yes. Okay. yes. yes. Number one. Number one. Okay. Number. Next. It involves the informal transmission of knowledge and social capital over a period of time with some face-to-face -face meetings, use of email and telephone communication. It is essential to have a mentor. Yes, mentoring. Number four. Number four. Number four. four. Mentoring. ¿Qué dice el público? Por ahí vi que nos hayan puesto que era in-house training, I don't know. No. no. Mentoring. Yes. Mentoring. Number okay. Mentoring. What, is, what is this one? What is this one? So this one is in house. In house training. Okay. Mm -hmm. I'm listening to you. It allows it allows people to learn at their own place and to apply new knowledge immediately. The trainer must be technically able to do the task and have the patience to teach or coach. Check. Check this class video so you can get all needed um, vocabulary, okay? Get, check the class again, the YouTube video, so you can review the vocabulary and repeat, 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 revise, revise, revise. Okay, questions? Questions, no questions, okay. Let me do the attendance now and we will discuss something really quick. Um, Ada Susana Caceres Mendoza. Present teacher. Please don't go, please don't go. Okay, not yet, we're missing six minutes. No. Alexander de Jesus Sanchez Soto. Present. Carla Ivania Cabrera Serrano. Present. Thank you. Claudia Maricela Solano Crespin. Claudia, 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 Claudia. She's not here anymore and I needed to tell her something, but anyways. Elvin Arcides de Guizabal Martinez. Present. Thank you. Fátima Ifegenia López Ramos. Present. Fernando Ernesto Cosme Morales. Isela Liliana Miranda Espinosa. Present. José Antonio Cubías Hernández. Carla Yanet Amaya Herrera. Present teacher. Miguel Ángel Paz Landa Verde. Okay. Miriam Carolina Mozo Valdés. Present. René Alfonso Madrid Escalante. Present teacher. Rina Marisabel Álvarez de Chávez. Present. Roberto Luis Umaño Orellana. Rina, um, Sabrina Mabel Latín Castro. Sabrina, 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 Sabrina. No, 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 no. Ok. Sandra Elizabeth Osorto Romero. Present. William Alexander Ramírez Flores. Jocelyn Imelda. Rivas Abarca. Present. Thank you. Alan Christopher Abrego Brizuela. I'm here. Good night. Wait, 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 wait. <laughs> Carolina Ivette Romero Avelino. Present. Good night. Wait. Johnny Vladimir <laughs> Portillo Chavez. <laughs> Present teacher. Thank you. Jose Alfredo Sandoval Sarabia. José Ángel Martínez Hernández and Juan Marcos Guzmán. ¿Y cuál es la prisa si ya están frías, hombre? Friday. Don't rush. Don't rush. Ya se derritió el hielo, hombre. <laughs> Because que... it's Friday. Come on. Ok, guys. No, todavía nos faltan cuatro minutos. Regáleme cuatro minutos de su valioso tiempo. Yo sé que el tiempo es dinero. Hey, um, gracias a todos de verdad por haber completado la plataforma. Solo hay dos personas que no me han realizado el examen final. Eh, quería hablar con Claudia de eso porque todavía no he realizado dos ejercicios. Es todo, todo, todo. Creo que ya todos estamos realmente. ¿Alguien tiene alguna duda en cuanto a la plataforma? ¿Algo que haga falta? 
New term, ya están todos realmente. Ok. A mí yeah. solo no me dejó, no me agarraba una respuesta de una pregunta, pero al final así la dejé porque traté con todas las formas posibles y nada. Eso no, cuando ocurra así, si quieren mejorar la nota, solo escríbanme y vemos. Pero díganme siempre, dicha el ejercicio 4.11, la raíz cuadrada de no sé qué, y lo revisamos, ok, y vemos qué es lo que pasó con ese ejercicio, porque sí he encontrado. Eh, por ejemplo, si nos notaron en el WhatsApp, le envié las respuestas a Ada, sí. Antier, creo. Y sí. fue por eso, porque las respuestas que están en la plataforma eh, tenía un espacio, una pregunta y, o sea, no van a adivinar ustedes que hay un espacio ahí. Ok, aparte de eso, recuerden, la encuesta no la vamos a hacer todavía, la vamos a hacer el lunes que cerramos el curso. Ya les enviaron la invitación para el siguiente módulo. Yes. Yes. No, no, no. 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 Solo la encuesta, no. Sí. no les han dado información de cuándo inicia el, el siguiente módulo. No. 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 Mm. Solo los requerimientos. Oh, I don't remember. Mm -hmm. Okay. So I'll keep my mouth shut. Okay. <laughs> Bien. Eh, recuerden, por favor, si van a salir ahora, ¿quién va a salir? A dormir. Solo son oh, bulles. Salir, salir a dormir. Ok. No, Antes, a dormir. Ok, solo me quedo con Rina 10 eh, minutos. Ya, solo un minuto. Al primero. baño. René, usted está. Usted está en el, en el gimnasio, René. ¿Cómo gimnasio? O sea, eh, en, o en el estadio, ajá. ¿eh? No, no, en el, en el polvorín. Sí, en el Indes, pero. Mm. Pero en, en el Polvorín, no sé si el complejo deportivo del Polvorín, el que está a la par del Chaguro Irau. Ni idea, pero lo voy a googlear para saber. El zoológico. Ah, oh, ok. okay. Ah, pues ahí adentro, donde está ciclismo, natación, el velódromo. No, pero está muy lejos. Sí. Sí, está muy lejos para mí. Bien lejos. Ok, chicos. I'll see you tomorrow. <risa> Okay. Good night. See you on Monday. See you on Monday. I'll miss you. I'll miss you. I'll see you tomorrow. Bye. I'll see you tomorrow. Bye. Thank you. Good night. Good night. Bye. Good night. Be alright with you. Ok, ahí está. Hola, ¿qué tal? ¿Cómo está, Rina? Dígame, ¿cómo le va? How bien, gracias a Dios. <ríe> bien, bien, por aquí estoy un poquito cansada. Uh -huh. En el sentido que este módulo no ha dado lo que yo tendría que haber dado porque me toca algo pesadito. Ayer a las once y media vine a la casa. <ríe> sí. ¿Y en qué sí. trabaja? Este, atiendo una cuenta. De, de en seguros Ajá, en seguros somos compañeros con Miguel ah, pero uh -huh, sí pero tengo otras actividades aparte entonces eso me absorbe un poquito de tiempo estoy tratando de desligarme un poquito para poderme <ríe> quedar al final, al final si no queda de otra pues yo le comprendo o sea, a veces ahorita estoy que estoy sin estoy tengo tiempo libre en la tarde y ya no aguanto, <ríe> tengo que estar haciendo algo, <ríe> necesito más trabajo, ya el lunes empiezo con más trabajo, de hecho uh, por rato digo yo, Dios mío quisiera des descansar, pero no, no me siento bien descansando, uh -huh. irónicamente es bien raro <ríe> yo soy al revés <ríe> pero ahorita quizás no sé, quizás son etapas, creo yo, son etapas Entonces, sí, sí, ahorita estoy tratando de arreglar el tiempo para para concentrarme pero pero sí este siento que eh, he aprendido he aprendido bastante porque este así siendo honesto <risa> los otros teachers no corregían así siendo honesto 
O sea, le decían. Pero era como que hagan esto. Go, go, go. go. O sea, le decían, go, go, sí, o sea, go. Pero no corregían, entonces uno se queda así, ¿verdad? Sí, está bien, lo seguimos lo haciendo, pero lo seguimos haciendo. Ok. Lo seguimos haciendo de la forma en que corresponde. Pero hoy sí. Hoy sí. Qué bueno, qué bueno. A ver, uh -huh. eh, mire, usted puede hacer esto solo en su casa. De hecho, y como le decía en la sesión anterior, es importante llegar a autocorregirse. Y es tan fácil, pero tan fácil. A ver, hagamos algo simple. Sí, eso estamos haciendo ahora con eh, Isela. Isela es, es en buena compañera porque me dice, ok, repeat, repeat. Y me pone a repetir la palabra. Thank you, thank you. Thank you, thank you. Bueno, thank you. Okay, vamos yeah. una prueba fácil. What do you do for a living? Let me show you. Every day I work teaching English and I also work at a call center. So for a living, I have to work as a teacher and as an employee at a call center. I also study. You know, I also study by myself online courses. I watch videos on YouTube and try to learn something new. That's what I do for a living. What do you do for a living? I am, I am teaching in, in the night on Thursday and On Thursday, on the night, I am teaching in Escuela Bíblica. How do you, how do you say? Um, Escuela Bíblica, it's okay. Mm -hmm. um, like something like Bible school. Mm -hmm. Ah, okay. At Bible school. Está lloviendo, se me va. Y se me va a mojar la ropa. No, pero no hay problema. Que sea ¿Segura? Sí, sí. Ok. Sí. okay. <laughs> um, I student with my, I student with my, with my, my son on the night. Um, I, every night, every night, I prepare, I prepare the dinner for the next day. And, um, uh, Mis actividades, I am. Se I like. Uh, I like. That's it. Okay. Can you hear me? ¿Me puede escuchar? Así es por el momento, sí. Ok, va, dejámoslo ahí, chivo. A ver, esto lo puede hacer usted. Grábese, entienda qué es lo que ha dicho. Vamos a ver. I'm teaching in the night. Ocupo las preposiciones in, at, on. Para todas las partes del día, casi que digo in the morning, in the afternoon, in the evening, pero at night. Ok. Y the night, uh, el artículo no lo necesito. I'm teaching at night mm -hmm. at a Bible school, at a Bible school. Yeah. I'm teaching at night at a Bible school. And I stu a student, uh, ¿cómo sería aquí? Sujeto, student. verbo, uh -huh. en su forma base, presente simple. Mm -hmm. And I study with my son. Otra vez, on the night, mm, at night. 
And I studied with my son at night. Para no sonar redundante, que incluso puedo decir además en la noche. So with my son also at night. Okay. Every night. Ay, perfecto. I prepare. Repeat. Prepare. Prepare. Mm -hmm. I prepare, prepare the dinner for the next day. Mm, yeah. Podría ver el artículo otra vez de, pero está bien. I prepare the dinner for the next day. Ah, por eso que suena redundante. I prepare dinner. Uh -huh. Vamos a hacerlo más general. I prepare dinner for the next day. Perfect. ¿Y de verdad hace esto? Yes. Ok. Ok. Vamos a pensar juntos. Cuando Rina está cocinando la cena. Y por cierto, ¿es la cena para el siguiente día o la comida para el siguiente día? The lunch. The lunch, ¿verdad? The lunch. Ok, yeah, yeah. ajá. Yo, que okay. híjole, de un the día para el otro. Ajá. <laughs> I prefer lunch for the next day. Sí, y mi esposa hace lo mismo aquí, la misma rutina. Solo que le voy a recomendar lo que hace ella. Eh, compre, mire, invierte en usted. ¿Cuántos años tiene su hijo? Tienen 20, no, 13. No, hombre, si eso ya no son niños. Galán, usted, yo tengo, le digo, a, a, acaba el 6 de agosto, el día del Salvador del Mundo, cumpleaños el gordo. 12, 9 y 6. Ahí estoy, 12, 9 y sí, 6. Yo sé. Mire, pero mi esposa hace algo y, y ahorita se me iluminó el foco con lo que usted me acaba de decir. Cómprese si no tiene unos earpods, unos audífonos, esos violadores, como decimos en salvadoreño, que, na, que nadie, que no escucha a nadie más, que usted lo que esté escuchando, póngase a ver una película en inglés, escucha música en inglés, vea una serie en inglés. Póngase a escuchar los audios que le recomendé la vez pasada. Un audio nada más. Está repitiendo, 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 repitiendo lo mismo. ¿Ya? Póngalo en looping ahí con el celular. Vea que él solo se esté repitiendo y repite, repite, repite. Mientras que está cocinando. ¿Qué es lo que hace mi esposo? Porque mi esposo puede ver series de Netflix, no sé qué cosas. ¿Ya? Pero es tiempo que se dedica para sí misma. Entonces le recomiendo eso. Se la va a relajar. Dedicarse tiempo a uno mismo es muy importante. Y ante todo, si usted se siente un poco mal, yo la siento a veces que, que se siente así como que, chica, yo podría dar más de mí misma. Claro que sí, sí lo puede hacer. Claro, se requiere un sacrificio mayor. Pero esto podría ser una idea, ¿no? Cuando tenga tiempo sí. libre, póngase los audífonos. ¿Sí? Claro, no le digo, esté viendo un video porque se va a quemar o se le va a quemar la comida. <risa> Entonces, ya invertí en uno de esos, de verdad. No tenía invertir este fin de semana en eso porque este sí, estoy tratando de, de darme más tiempo, como usted dice, no creo, ya lo había pensado. En, 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 incluso quiero descargar un audiolibro, aunque sea en inglés, porque quiero escuchar palabras. Porque yo siento que el vocabulario es el que siempre me, me quedo corta. Y Pero, sí, la práctica. O sea, yo le recomendaría una aplicación de, de palabras. Uh -huh. Palabras, estar escuchando uh -huh. la palabra y repetirla. Como que le estoy diciendo al oído, Apple, Apple. Uh -huh. Y de nuevo, Apple, Apple. Y ahí va, no sé, Duolingo, no sé. Hay tantas aplicaciones hoy en día que puede ocupar. Y le va a ayudar en realidad, o sea, al final, mire... ¿Usted cree que yo quiero hacer ejercicio? No, pero me juré en el 2016 que no iba a llegar a los 40 sin tener el six pack, sin tener, o sea, que no iba a llegar a los 40 con panza, que le tengo heredada a mi papá, de la misma barriga. Entonces me juré que a los 40 no, no iba a llegar así. Me está costando, pero por cinco días seguidos, como lo hice en el 2016, por cinco días seguidos, He podido hacer rutinas de 30, 45 minutos. A veces me duele y me da una pereza. Pero digo yo, si no es ahora, ¿cuándo? ¿Cuándo? O sea, sí. Yo no sé si mañana voy a estar vivo. Si mejor, es. Ahorita, ahorita. Y con esa paja, como decimos los salvadoreños, así me voy llevando. Yo solo me voy empujando porque ya sé que me da pereza. No, no, ahorita, ahorita. Y ahí estoy con el gordo, lo mismo. Vamos, démosle. Porque solo con él paso todo el día. Démosle, sentárate. No, 
Y me dice, casi siempre es como que no me da, pero estamos un poquito a poco. Sí. Aunque sea un poquito. Estoy. Ok. Ok, teacher. Se le va a ayudar. Le agradezco. Feliz noche. Le agradezco mucho. Y... Sí, no, no me voy a, no me voy a rendir. Eso. De verdad. Okay. <risa> no lo voy a hacer. Good night. Bye, good Take night. Care.